Hi everybody, welcome to another evening with Sips. Tonight we're going on a super amazing wagon adventure. Turbo, apparently. How can this game not be good? It's called Super Amazing Wagon Adventure. I don't know if you're like me, but I played the hell out of Oregon Trail when I was uh, when I was younger, and we had a whole bunch of Apple Macs at school, and I'm expecting this to be like that. I hope it's like that. If it's not like that, uh, maybe I'll be disappointed. I have no idea. I really don't know what to expect. This cost me one pound on Steam. Uh, so I felt like I, I had to buy it. So here we go, Super Amazing Wagon Adventure. I'm looking forward to this. Look at that guy sitting on the wagon. He's got a gun. He's being pulled by some sort of bull, I guess. Uh, and his wagon looks utterly fantastic. Holy shit. All right, press in space. What do we want? Start adventure, survival, shuffle, which I don't have access to. I just want to start an adventure. Let's do it. I'm starting Let's an adventure. Go adventure. Oh, shit. Between 1830 and 1870, nearly half a million Americans migrated west over wagon trails. It's true. Oh shit, I missed the other part! Stephen, George, and Mary. Good enough for me. <laughs> I can randomize, apparently. I can also edit. Would I like to edit this? Maybe give Mary, like, some better hair than she has at the moment? Uh, or George, maybe? I don't know. Stephen, George, and Mary look pretty good to me. Let's go for it. Stephen, George, and Mary. All right. Three dudes on a wagon. Traveling west. They traveled in... Oh, I missed that again. <laughs> I'm too slow. The standard. Completely average. Whoa, look at this one. The fantasy unlocked by magic. Oh, the invisible unlocked by self-discovery. Oh, the fast unlocked by jumping very high. Okay, I have to unlock wagons. Great, the glitch unlocked by breaking the game. I might be able to do that, hopefully. The wild, unlocked by being one with nature, all right. The coal fired, look at that. Look at the, w the wagon is actually a train, unlocked by catching a train. Oh, fantastic. The disease, oh my god. <laughs> Just like a corpse wagon, great. Unlocked by catching something. All right, we should be able to unlock some of these. Where's the, uh, where's the normal one? The fancy, the survivalist, the golden, the random, the meta, the standard. Completely average. The only one I can take. Fine. Day one, they set off into the forest. No, why? Okay, default controls. Got it. Uh, or I can click or space. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, no. I'm not good at these games. <laughs> Seeing some animals in an upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on food for the long journey. Day four. Oh, shit. We're going really fast now. All right, skunk, come on. <laughs> we need... I want to eat some skunk for dinner! Alright, uh, also, lots of gears. Oh shit, I don't know if I'm doing very good here. Can I just- oh yeah, I can, okay. Apparently I can use the- oh, okay, that's a little bit better. A posse of bandits interrupted the hunt- no! Bandits! Mary took one! Mary has taken one to the door- oh shit, I'm very good at this actually, look at this. Oh, no problem. Do I run out of uh, ammo ever? Oh, I can, eventually, I think. Not now though, look, I have 999 gunshots. Oh shit, Mary. Mary is like our meat shield right now. She's taking many hits. No! Ah! Oh, that time it was Steven. Steven, I'm sorry. A machine gun armed bandit. Oh my lord! Oh shit! <laughs> fucking machine gun armed bandit! My, this is fucking bullshit! Where did he get that thing? It's like 1870! They didn't have machine guns back then! Jesus Christ! Oh fuck! Oh shit! A bullet hit Mary in the head! Kill it! Alright, Mary's dead. <laughs> Fucking poor Mary! Shot by a machine gun, of all things. Like, okay, holy shit, this guy can take a beating. Alright, day 13. Steven sat on the pistol and accidentally bent the barrel. Steven, what the fuck? George left the wagon to look for wild berries. My god, this is quite the adventure. Oh, we're on foot now. Default controls, okay? Aw, oh, shit. Can I use the mouse for this? I hope so. We're about to find out. Oh yeah, you can aim! Oh, okay, great. Let's shoot the bush. Can you shoot? No, you can't. Oh. We're collecting berries. Oh. Fantastic. On his way back to the wagon, George noticed an, in an entrance to a cave. He decided to investigate. No. George, don't investigate the cave. It's never a good idea. It was very dark inside. Oh, shit. Upon lighting a torch, he found it was filled with giants. Oh, Jesus! George, what the hell? Why would you do this to yourself? Why would you go in a cave? Have you ever played Skyrim? I mean, come on, you don't go into a cave. 
I cannot aim. Holy shit. There we go. George ran from the cave back to the wagon. Jesus. They fixed the bend in the pistol. Day 24. My god. We're actually doing well. Steven and George. They reached a river crossing. Oh, fucking son of a bitch. What do I do here? George had the brilliant idea to try to jump over the river. Alternatively, they could ford it. Um... Can you actually jump a river with a wagon? Oh, fuck it. We're gonna try. <laughs> they got a running start and left from the top of a ledge. Ah, oh, this... This couldn't possibly go wrong. Look at that. Somehow they safely... Yay! Hey, we did it! Day 35! Wow! They, they entered into the desert. Oh, shit. Listen to this. George came down with purple fever. How can anyone develop purple... George. George is hideously mutating. They came across a large herd of buffalo. Oh, great. Come on, buffalo. I'm back you. Oh, shit. Look at this. Oh, we got the spread gun. Oh, my God. A bison. <laughs> God, George. What? What happened to George? Okay, well, George had to clap anyway. He was never going to survive. Day 42, Stephen got bored of all the repetitive buffalo encounters, so he sped off. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Steven was trampled to death by a buffalo. That was too quick. Steven, too quick. The party's journey ended there. The remain... Oh, I can't believe it. Wow. Holy shit, that was the most intense eight minutes of my entire fucking life. My god. <laughs> I feel like I want to do it again, though. I mean, that was incredible. I especially like the Van Halen music in the desert. I thought that was a nice touch. All right, we're doing it again. Now that we know what to do, we're starting another adventure. Let's go there we go. This is the story of one party of three and their adventure. That's the part I missed last time. This game moves very fast. A word of warning for you if you decide to spend one pound to pick this up. Holy shit. Uh, Paul, William, and Richard. My god, it's a real sausage party on the wagon today. We got Paul, William, and Richard. Richard, of course, uh, and Paul look like they could be descendants of possibly Santa Claus. Uh, otherwise, maybe the, uh, the the big bad guy in Half-Life 2 looks exactly like him. William just looks like maybe like an American police officer. Um, you're, you're sort of quintessential American police officer back in the 1830s or 1870s. Can't remember. Who fucking cares? Let's go. Paul, William, and Richard. Did we unlock any new wagons? No. We did not get the fantasy. Ah, oh, shit. All right, we're going to go with the standard. At least we know that the standard can jump over rivers. So that's a good thing, right? No? Me? Who knows? Day one. They set off into the forest. All right, we got this. No problem. Oh, look at this. Seeing some animals in an upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on food for the long journey. All right, we know what to do here. The, the adventure is more or less the same every time, I'm, I'm guessing, or maybe it randomizes, who knows? Maybe this time we'll end up like in the, uh, in the Sahara Desert. Oh shit! This didn't happen last time. Also, uh, George, I think, a posse of bandits, okay. We've got a machine gun this time, though. Oh no, we've lost the machine gun. Oh shit, look at that! Got the double on him and the horse. Oh look, fucking bandits. Take that. Oh, what's this? Oh! Oh! Oh, this is much easier! Oh, sh oh shit! Uh, sorry, Larry or Lenny or whatever your name is. I can never remember the names. Oh, here comes the machine gun guy. All right. Poor Mary last time. Can't believe it. All right, Mary. It's time to avenge your, your beautiful ass. Okay. Oh, shit. Took, took a slight hit. Didn't mean to. I mean, it'd be nice to actually get through this without getting anyone shot. There! Paul left the wagon to look for wild berries. Day 13, Paul, the hero of the rebellion, has picked up many berries. On his way back to the wagon, Paul heard a noise in the trees. A bear wanted the bear. Paul, run for your goddamn life. There's a bear coming out. Oh, in his last dying breath, the bear let out a cry for help. The bear's extended family heard the gosh shit. No, a family of bears, Paul. You're in big trouble now. There's a lot of bears converging on you. Shit, we just killed a... A, a baby bear! I can't believe it! We one-shot as well with a pistol! God, this is one huge bear family, my lord! Oh, oh. Well, Survival mode unlocked. Oh shit, look at that! Hard to bear! Survival mode! Thanks to Paul. Paul ran back to the wagon. <laughs> they reached the river crossing! Oh shit, here we go. 
Can we chance it again? William had the brilliant idea to try to jump over the river. Alternatively, they could ford it. I think fording it is going to be really difficult. And maybe we won't be able to do this jump because we have three grown-ass men on the wagon. Dare we try it? Oh, we're fucking trying it again. They got a running start and left from the top of a ledge. Oh, Jesus Christ. Here we go. Wee! Oh my god, I think we overshot it a bit. A gust of air pulled them up into low Earth orbit. No! What? <laughs> what the fuck? They passed through a meteor sh- How? No! I do not want to dodge meteors in my wagon! Oh, this is difficult. Oh, shit. Oh my god. Guys, I bet you never thought this- Oh, no. We hit one. <laughs> the wagon's burning up. Watch out, call Bruce! We need Bruce Willis to save us! Oh, shit! Richard was killed by a meteor! Oh no! They came across a strange machine? I wanted that help! What is this?! What?! Why is there a satellite shooting me?! I don't know! I don't know- I don't understand why the satellite has it in for me and my wagon posse, but... We're gonna- We're gonna get to the bottom of it one way or another. Oh shit! I think Richard might actually fight me. Here, though. Or did Richard already die? Pretty sure Richard is actually already dead. Oh, the wagon fell out of orbit. Thank God for that. Oh no! Oh, this is gonna be hard. By chance, <laughs> by chance, they land in the same river they had jumped over days before. Oh shit! Wagon unlock. The fast. Oh, look at that! A spaceship wagon. Oh no! We did it! They entered into the Great Plains. Oh shit! Here we are. The Great. Oh, I thought this was a desert last time. They came across a large herd of buttons. No, not this again. Okay, I swear I got stuck last time. Gotta get sort of clear up. Oh, shit, no! Paul was gorged by bison and died. We have to clear a path. Alright, come on, Wesley or whatever your name is. I can never remember. It, we don't have to kill all the buffalo. We just need to clear a path through the buffalo. Oh, shit, no! William! Oh, this is very hard. The party's journey ended there as the buffalo played with the wreckage that was once a wagon. Game over. Ah, oh, damn it. God damn it. I must try again. Start Let's the adventure. This time is gonna be better. I promise you. It's gotta be better this time. I'm gonna get past the buffalo stage. And maybe we can use a different wagon. We got Catherine, Andrew, and Kevin. Wow. Catherine. Wah wah wee wah. <laughs> You're looking fine today. Look, she's got a really, really large clown nose now. Good job, Catherine. Okay, Catherine, Andrew, and Kevin, you're up. They traveled in their trusty wagon. Oh, we're going for it this time. Look at this. Oh, I think I need to wait for the mouse thing to go away. Or maybe it's decided that I just want to use mouse full time now. Oh, here we go. Look at this. The fast. It moves quickly. Am I ready for this? Hell yeah, I'm ready for this. <laughs> they set off into the forest. It's not that fast. Come on. We've got a NASA space shuttle. For wagon. Seeing some animals in an upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. No problem. Day two. Man, holy shit, the last try was something else. Going into space and accidentally jumping too high into space. You gotta hate when that happens. Oh, look at this. Catherine. Catherine has recharged her batteries in a major way. Oh, luckily, this one's all run away. A posse of bandits interrupted the hunt. Wow, good thing Catherine and. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no, Tom. Oh, what's this? What's, what was that guy's name again? Thomas? He's about to die anyway. Catherine also lost a bit of juice. And so did, um... Rupert? Fuck, I can't remember their names now. Oh shit, there, Thomas is back on like almost full health. Great. Alright, you bandits. Take this. Here comes the machine gun bandit. No problem. Oh no, oh shit, I really miscalculated that. Oh, battle passed through a large nest of skunks. Oh my god. Why did- Why is there a skunk nest here? This makes it difficult now. Well, at least we got the NASA's shit. I wish there was some way that we could- Oh, what's this? A bazooka? Oh, it is. Ah, fucking- <laughs> Oh no, Catherine. She died from blood loss after a bullet passed through her. I don't know. I, I couldn't, couldn't quite read it. Maybe it was her, like, I don't know, uterus. Kevin left the wagon to look for wild berries. Oh. I think we destroyed the bandits. Uh, with the rocket launcher. Good job, Kevin. On his way back to the wagon, Kevin noticed a beautiful rainbow. Aww. Kevin <laughs> considered the rainbow a sign of good things to come. They reached a river crossing. Aww. 
Hopefully we can jump up to the rainbow now that it's only Kevin and Andrew had the brilliant idea to try to jump over the river. Okay. Let's try the fort. No, let's jump it. It's, it's much more fun jumping over a river. They got a running start and leapt from the top of a ledge. Oh, shit. I think we're going to do it. They only made it halfway across the river. They landed in the middle of some rapids. Oh, shit. Watch out. Oh, no. A boulder knocked Kevin out of the wagon and he drowned. <laughs> Straight away. Oh, shit. This is... It's very hard to navigate these rapids. I think we need to go like... There we go. Oh, no. They're coming from the other way now. This isn't too bad, actually. Luckily, the um, rocks are placed much like a road, uh, but in the water, which which is helpful. It's not too difficult. We got the NASA space shuttle wagon, so it's no problem. Here we go. Holy shit, this goes on forever. Maybe this is just Andrew's uh, personal hell, or did Andrew just die? Like, I'm, I'm having trouble keeping track, because this game is just nuts. It really is just nuts. Maybe we have to, like, speed ahead. There we go! Finally, Andrew reached the other side of the river! Oh, great. Okay. We did it! Andrew entered into the Great Plains! Oh, shit, no, not the buffaloes. I'm... I'm not prepared for the buffaloes. Andrew came across a large herd of buffalo. Okay, Andrew. Alright. Get your game face. Oh, shit! A buffalo smashed into Andrew, causing massive internal bleeding and a slow, painful... Fuck, Andrew! Jesus! What the hell? What was- what were you thinking? Game over. Game over. God. What a complete bastard. What a fucking bat. Okay, well. Jesus Christ. Super wagon adventure. I think I need to take some sort of sleep or, or something now, because that was just too much. That was too much excitement for one session of gaming, for me. I'm not used to this level of excitement. Normally I like to play very boring, slow-paced games. This, of course, is a very fast-paced action game, and uh, it's kind of nuts. Actually, very fun, though. Uh, I would love to unlock all of the uh, extra wagons and different modes and stuff, like the survival mode. What was this? Hard to bear. Let's try it. Hard to bear, best time. Let's go. Aw, oh, a fucking no problem. Look at this. We just got to kill squirrels with a gun. We're some sort of, like, oh, shit, there's bears, too. Watch out. That, that makes things a little bit more difficult. Is that a skunk? Fuck you, skunk. Oh, shit! What happened there? Okay, I got some health. Oh, man, this is great. I, I guess you just survive for, like, as long as you can. Look, 18 seconds. That's probably a world record right now. I'm pretty pro at this. My APM is high. Uh, my, my reaction times are, like, off, off the scales. Fuck, another dead squirrel. Oh, shit. This bear is getting a bit fresh. It's like a turkey here. Another skunk. Oh, what's this? It's like a Tommy gun. Oh, got spread. Oh, it's just like Contra. Bow and arrow. Oh, shit. Watch out. Oh, what? Oh, shit. They're moving a lot faster now. We're, we're coming up to a minute. I'm back with the handgun. I'm killing child bears. Watch out, child bears. Oh, my lord. Well, luckily, we got some sort of laser gun here. It really saved my ass. Oh, shit. Freaking bloodbath out here. Look at this. Oh, there we go. Oh, man. You gotta like those cruising shots that just connect. Or like that one. I actually shot that skunk in the butt. And I didn't even mean to shoot that other skunk. It just happened. Great. Oh, shit. Watch out. Those angry squirrels. They're just trying to hibernate. All they want to do is hibernate and be left alone. And I'm not letting them. Oh, shit. Watch out. Fucking angry child. Oh! Ruth! Oh, Ruth was devoured by a million angry child bears. New best time. Oh, what do you know? I got one star because I suck so bad. But look at that. My time. 131. Best time. 131. No more. <laughs> that is well and truly enough of super amazing, awesome, radical wagon super adventure for now. Um, I, I definitely need to sort of uh, lie down in a dark room and, and really have a long hard think about my life and the direction that, that I'm taking and, uh, and whether or not I ever want to play this game again. It's action packed, it certainly is. And uh, for the low low price of one pound, I highly recommend it. it. It is really fun actually, it's a lot of fun to just pick up and play for a bit. I don't know if you'd want to like play for like nine hours straight. Well, maybe you would actually. You know, you'd probably get better, and then you'd be able to go like uh, pro, go on a world tour, you know, go to the championships in Korea and stuff. 
probably get like some sort of golden trophy and maybe a ribbon and you know, some sort of like mystical kazoo or something as a prize. But, um, but there you go. All right. Well, that was yet another evening with Sips. I hope you enjoyed that super amazing wagon adventure. Um, as usual, thanks for watching and uh, see you next time.